What's up everyone? Welcome to Pop Culture's Group Chat, where we come to dish on the news of the week that we care about. I'm Anna Rumer. And I'm Jose Bastidas. So let's dive in. Unbox your wine, ladies, because we got our first official look at Hannah Brown as The Bachelorette this week. And this season, the ABC dating show had another swing and a miss when it comes to monetizing feminism. In this climate? In the season's first trailer, the pageant queen rips the skirt off her Cinderella-like gown to reveal, she's wearing pants, guys, watch out! As You Don't Own Me plays in the background, Hannah B is like, man, watch out, this skirt's also pants! I can just picture the marketing bros putting this together being like, okay, pants, great start. But also, let's make sure she's still hot, right? And under 25. Because nothing screams ready for commitment than being 22 and blonde, right, Anna? You know, the moment I hit my mid-20s, I threw my dowry into the sea. Won't be needing that, I'm an old hag. The Bachelorette teaches us life ends after 24. It does. From the new age of TV feminism to the week's pettiest news, I am ready to talk about Tarek El Moussa's accidental baby gender reveal. I live for pettiness. While on an interview with TMZ Live, the flipper flop star spilled the beans on the gender of ex-wife Christina Anstead's new baby with husband Ant. That baby's gonna be a small baby if he's an ant. Do you need to lie down? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, Tarek revealed that his fellow HGTV stars are expecting a baby boy, prompting this passive-aggressive response from Christina's publicist. While Christina and Ant wish they could have shared the news themselves, they are very excited to welcome a baby boy in the fall. And then a bird swooped down and ate Ant, along with all six of his tiny little legs. No, we're getting off topic. Or are we getting on topic? <laughs> I don't know. It honestly sounds like Tarek made a simple mistake, and I find the pettiness lacking. Accident or not, we love pettiness here at Group Chat and choose to pay tribute to the brave, messy souls of HGTV. This episode goes out to all those who love to spill that tea. Thanks for watching Group Chat. Check out all our coverage at popculture.com and come see us next time. Also, Jose told me not to tell, but he spends his weekends in a cave guarding his treasure from wayward hobbits. How dare you! Ah!